Hello everybody, welcome back. Today we're playing another game of League of Legends, Platinum Support Game, trying to carry our way up to Diamonds. Only playing support. Uh, I do have a duo in this game, uh, right here. He is gold 2, so he's lower than me. So I don't duo with people that often, um, but when I do for this series, it will be with people that are lower than me. I don't want to duo with people who are Diamond to get my way up to Diamond. Not that there's anything wrong with that. I just would like the challenge of trying to do it as support, kind of on fair grounds here. Um, um, and I did ban Tom Kench, who's my favorite support. But... I don't know. I've been playing some diverse stuff lately. I've been having some okay success. I just, I think, I, I don't remember how many I've won in a row. I think I've won two games in a row. I don't remember. I'm starting to get back, win a few here. Um, I just did Nautilus last game. I did Sona the game before that. Um, now, I do like Zyra with Vayne, or with Draven, because that's a lot of burst damage. Nami's also good. Sona would be good. Um, Sona is quite good. But uh, Zyra is quite good too. Zyra is particularly good into Thresh because he's such an easy target to hit. I think I'm going to do Zyra here. Now I may actually get kills, which is not good for Draven. I mean, um, if I get the kills. But... I think I'm gonna do it. Feel the thorns embrace. Now they could pick a couple of assassins here, but these three, none of them are spectacular against Zyra. And I can also buy a Morello, so if no one else. And it kind of goes together with Sezwani and Cannon thematically in terms of if we're going for that AoE CC team fight, it just fits with what the team's trying to do. Um, I need to get a, uh, I need to get a penetration page here. I've got a Zyra page with armor, um, but it's just AP, it's not penetration. I think penetration's better. Yeah, so I think, I think we should be good here. And as far as this goes, I just go down to Thunderlords and then just get over here. I'm not really sure about this, uh... I think I want 3% extra damage from your allies. That would be good. Or ideal 3% extra damage. Huh. Come on, expose weakness. Extra damage. Um, I definitely want Thunderlords. Oh, this is good. Do I want that or do I want... I think I want this. It's hard to say. Let me know in the comments which one you think I should get. I think because everyone else gets to deal an extra 3% damage instead of just me. That's, I mean, basically what it comes down to is in a team fight, am I going to do more damage than my other four teammates? And I think the answer is no. So I think the exposed weakness is really good. Yeah, so they don't have really good stuff. I mean, if Thresh hits uh, me with a hook, we're going to have a problem. But... As long as I stay behind waves, the difference is I can actually cast my CC through waves. He can't. So as long as we're behind waves, I think we should be fine. Um, we have a lot of damage. We have a lot of kill threat. Um, I like this team. I think it's pretty good in theory. Um, Vlad is probably going to beat up on Kennen. But I hope we can handle him later in the game. I think I think we can. Ari should beat up on Velkaz. That's a good Ari. And I think I like Sejuani over Skarner. And Draven is very similar to Vayne, I think. He just has higher burst. I mean, Vayne has more mobility if you use her correctly and roll around while you're invisible, but if I just put out a pink ward, um, and it shouldn't be that much of a problem. I think that Draven can beat her up in a one-on-one -on -one fight. Even later into the game, as long as they're relatively similar items. Uh, 
Draven and the Draven's good. I mean, Draven's really hard to play because you have to catch those axes and fight. But they don't have a lot of, like, skill shots they can punish him with. I mean, they have the Thresh. I mean, I guess they do. They have Thresh and Vel'Koz. But realistically, I mean, this is probably a high gold game since I've duoed. Um, I don't think it's going to be that. Uh, I don't think people are going to understand that mechanic that well. Like, oh, his axes are going here, so I just save my CC for when he goes for those axes. I mean, they might. But I don't I don't think people are going to punish that Draven pick as much as they might in a higher elo, is what I'm trying to say. Another Zyra game here. I did pretty well in the last Zyra game. Um, it's not going to show up on this channel. We ended up losing the game, but I was playing fairly well with it. Um, I'm going to try to gain control of this. I, don't, I can't, just yet. It's been a while since I played against the Skarner, so I'm not still not quite sure how these things work. Thirty seconds until minions spawn. So if a fight breaks out here, I'm good to go. I need to be putting these under um, the Sejuani where Sej is going to go, but such a busy world. I just want to stand, like, right here. Well, I don't want them to appear on that side. There we go. We get two plants here. Nice. Is it just randomly one or two plants? I don't really know how that works. Not a great place for those plants, but that's okay. Now, they just nerfed her a little bit recently. I'm not really sure. I think her W takes longer or something to get the plants going. I'm not really sure. Oh, he just crushed it immediately. I really have to wait on level 2 for it, because the mana costs are still kind of high at level 1 for Zyra. It's not really worth it unless you hit a plant with it. Oh, gosh. It's actually been a very long time since I've had DCs. Because that uh, doesn't happen as much at higher elo either, because people who chronically have bad connections just don't gain elo at some point. That's pretty good. I'll take it. Jeez, that cannon minion's going for him. I'm going to go ahead and just push this up just so he can back because it's too dangerous for him to stay. Oh, I guess he does have the life healing thing. I forgot about that. So I guess we could stay. She goes up for that... Um, Cannon minion, I'm gonna kill her. I think I I don't know if she missed it or not, I didn't see. I was focusing too hard. I don't care. We got a Who's our jungler? Skarner. So Skarner could come kill us. It's a little dangerous. Syra is obviously not very good at getting out of uh, tough situations. This Thresh is out of position a lot. He's just waiting to die. I'm going to let him push up a little bit here. Some people ask, well, why do you put the melee plants on him? I put the melee plants on him because it slows him.
I thought he was going to go for it straight away. It's not bad. Uh, back up, back up. Jeez. I don't have anything. Oh, back, back. Did I get him? Okay, I got him. See, I just killed him. Alright, so... I probably want this, and then I think I want health, and... Uh, a fairy charm, I guess? Dang it, I don't have a fairy charm. There we go. This, and a pink. Okay, that'll be fine. Draven should be pretty far ahead. I mean, he did get a kill. That was kind of early, so he didn't have a lot of stacks, but... Bane hasn't even backed yet, so that's good. So I don't have a Sight Stone, which is very dangerous. Um, we don't have a lot of escapes. I do still have Flash. I mean, they want to back. If they back, she's going to miss this entire wave. I think she wants to back, though. Don't let him back. Let it push up. Yeah, he's right. We can just zone this. So you want to go? Okay, yeah, he wants to go. So we could have just let it keep going towards us, which would probably be smarter, because we don't have a good escape from Skarner, but whatever. This will give us some damage on this, which is nice. I need to get this Thresh, because Bane can roll away. Thresh really can't. Daggummit, they're just going to camp us, because we don't have a lot of good escapes. Like, unless we have, um, says Wani in the area, we need to back up. That's the thing, Zyra is very susceptible to getting camped, but I think they'll be able to get some kills here. Dragon's beating up that guy. Uh, he's gonna die, though. Ari, please don't. Come on, you little clowns, stay. Get a couple of hits on her. Since I hit six, we can blow them all up. If they, I think we can do a 2v3 once I hit 6. I'm just not 6 yet, so. There we go. 
I think we can beat up Skarner if Skarner shows up. So I really need some boots. Jeez, what is going on? Eleven hundred, huh? I'll go ahead and sell this. He's gonna be like, we need to. I want to keep laning, guys, but the thing is, we can't lane anymore. Oh, Draven? What? What? Please tell me he gets him. Okay, good. Alright, um... I mean, I guess I could try to get... I've never tried... I'll try to get that item again now. I haven't tried it since the nerf. I mean, maybe it's better than I think it is. That, um... What the heck is this item called? Frost Queen's Claim. It's still pretty good. I mean, the slow is relevant, for sure. Got that little lightning bolt over his head. He's like really confused. He doesn't know what to do there. I'm just hanging out, waiting on someone to come right here. Hit that charm. Oh, he just hit it with a nice. Oh, jeez. Can we do this? Vlad's gone. Vayne's bottom. Three are dead. I'm just 
just trying to watch here. He's probably going to come from right, right there if he comes from anywhere. Okay. Let's go ahead and finish up this Frost Queen. So now let's go ahead and start working. Um, Thresh is real easy to pick. He's always out of position. Like he's just not cautious about shadows. So I should be able to just bush him a lot. That is one thing with Zyra you can do is you can bush and zero people out, even as support, which is nice. She's one of the only good supports that can do that. I mean, if she actually hit that. Scar is in that bush, he just showed. Ah, I missed him. Dang it, if I would have hit him, he would have died. Everybody missed everything. Guys, come on. Oh, don't take a tower shot, man. Come on. Oh, that lifesteal, though. Nice. Okay, yeah, we gotta get out of here. Get... Just keep getting the mask. Zyra just scales very, very well with Pin because her base damage is pretty high. Her AP scaling is not all that great, I don't think. It's okay. I guess about 50% on that one. Uh, and about 50% on that one. But the plant damage, see the plant only gets 17 extra damage off of 113 AP, so it doesn't really scale well at all. It's that base penetration. That's what you want. She... Okay, I might get an Abyssal, actually, here in a little bit. I need to be careful here. Nah, I should have upgraded my Sweeper, too. I forget to do that way too much. A little on the dangerous side. Now, I need to save this pink for, um... Uh, Vein. Let's get back over here and get this. Alright. No, oh, she just hit that. Trying to save my plants a little bit. Are they all gonna die? Probably, yeah.
All right. Just letting them know we aren't looking for the re-engage there. I think I just want health, or actually no, I want uh, this for more penetration. Yeah, I think that. That's what I want. I need to get this. Oh. Get. Okay. Quite have enough people around here to make a play on that just yet. Oh my gosh! Probably trying to get a little too cute. Rampage. Uh, I guess they got it. There we go. There's nothing else really I can get. I guess I can get this. That'll be fine. Give me some more wards. No, I don't have a pink for Vayne, which is problematic. But I think it's okay. I mean, she's not really that strong yet. This uh, this item in conjunction with uh, the Frost Queens might actually be a good thing. An extra CC is always good, right? Man, be careful. Need to group and get some more towers, what we need. I just want to use that just to see if there's anyone in their jungle. There's not. That is one good thing about Frost Queens with Zyros. You get so much extra scouting with your uh, seeds and uh, and the Frost Queens itself. Okay, let's just yeah, let's fight a drag. Oh gosh, guys, come on! Quit trying to make the play. Just let's go. Okay, they're gonna try to go on him.
No. Okay. Thank goodness. Pretty sure, yeah, all the threats are dead. I just can't get killed by dragon here. I think that's good enough. I can go ahead and back. Are you serious? Oh my gosh. She's gonna lose that. Wow. Alright. Um, 11.30, don't have it. Don't have anything I can do. Did she actually get out of it? Okay, well, at least there's that. I mean, I didn't have anything else left I could do. I had, like, one thing and no plants. I mean, I guess maybe I should have held on to some plants or at least warded around. I didn't think Skarner was gonna try to dive in 1v3, though. That's just what I'm saying. Like, I'm not used to this, like... This is a, feels like a pretty high-level game, at least relative to what I had been playing. So maybe if I duo, I actually get into a higher elo. <laughs> it's so ridiculous. I mean, you should, like... If you duo with someone who's lower than you, it should pull them closer to your division. Because th they can assume that you're probably going to have voice comms, and you're going to have a better level level of familiarity and communication with each other. So I get that. That makes sense. But it's like... When I solo queue, I get silvers on my team. When I duo queue with a mid gold, then I get gold platinums on my team. So it's almost like I should just duo queue just so I can get a higher elo. Come on, go across that wall, go across that wall. He's not going to do it. In the dark, baby. Back up! Oh god. Can we not dive? Can we just like get objectives? I guess we get a tower out of it, that's okay, but... Okay, Ari. Alright, get out, get out. We don't have oracles, man. I mean, I guess I do have the, the item. Um, yeah, I'll get a couple things, I guess. Whatever, it's fine. So I do like Zyra in the right matchups. I mean, they banned out Tom Kinchley. It wasn't even an option this time, but Zyra does have really nice lane pressure. And the thing is, the lower the elo that you're playing and the better lane pressure is also, because people aren't going to dodge your skill shots. And they're not going to punish you for going on cooldown as often as they will in higher elos. Okay, let's go. What's going on here? Why are we getting blue? I've got so many plants around this. Let's go. I'm gonna keep a couple out here. Have ults left? No. It's alright. Can we get this versus all three of them? I mean, we do have a lot of Baron minions here. I think we probably can. Let's go ahead and put a pink here just for Bane shenanigans. 
I'm just saving this for Vayne rolling in, or... Right there is a good one. What? My god, are you serious? Get it, minions, get it, minions! Yes! Okay. Alright, that was a goofy game, but I guess we'll take it. So that was pretty sweet. I guess I'll keep going, you know, if I keep winning with this guy, uh, I'll just keep going, so. Um, I mean, at least one of the major reasons why I like doing this now is because I'm guaranteed to get golds and platinums on my team. Uh, that's all I want. I just want to play platinum games. I'm not on voice comms with this guy. We're not abusing anything. He's not even in my lane. I don't think so. So, um... I don't know. Now, if I'm Tom Kinch, also, with Chinga, I can trust him, um... I can trust him if he's in the jungle, if I get Tom Kench to help follow me down here. Um, I can Tom behind him and get kills. And Tom's very good with, uh, with Jin. I don't know what this guy's talking about. And we getting trolled again. I hope he doesn't double smite, man. Come on, don't troll. I just kind of want to see. I can't really see what the um, what the ranks of the last people were that I played with. I mean, I could just use one of those apps or whatever just to see, like, what the elo of everyone is. Um, but let me just... I'll look up the... Uh, Draven. What is that? Lively Telemon? Uh, gold 2. Okay, so at least it's, like, high gold. Well, I can't pick Zyra into Zed. I kind of wanted a Zyra, but can't do it. I think uh, Tom Kench needs to be the pick. Tom Kench is very good with uh, with Jen. Zyra is very good with Jen. Almost everybody is very good with Jen. Uh, could Leona? Nami's just gonna get blown up. Like, I need something tanky. I don't know what they're gonna pick. I think Tom. I'll just go Tom Kench. It's fine. Call me King. Call me Demon. Water forgets the names of the drowned. Alright, so let's just go Tom. I don't know if I need MR or not yet. Janna's also decent into Zed. The shield blocks some, but if it gets to the point where it's just like way too strong, like Jen just has way too much power, um, or not Jen, Zed, then uh, Janna's shield's not gonna help. Uh, I like Jen better, but Ezreal's still okay. 
Because you're already really safe with uh, Tom Kench, so... Jin's like the best AD carry with Tom Kench, I'm pretty sure. Dang it, they get Jin. Oh, that just went got really bad really quickly. They get Jin and Rise. We don't have a ton of CC or any way to get to that Jin. I mean, says Wani can get to him. That's about it. I mean, if I would have known that this is what was going to be going on, okay, good. Sandra can get to him. I would have picked Nautilus if I would have known they were going to go Jin. This is okay. Okay, so uh, that's a Karma bottom. So I need a Tom No MR. Okay, so hopefully he's on board with that. It is nice to have a jungler that you're playing with if you're uh, Tom Kinch. Because using that ult is just so abusive Like if people actually use it. All right, I'm going to be gone for just one second. I'm going to grab a drink real quick. I've just been doing rapid fire. Did I even start a new... Let me see. Did I even start a new uh, thing? I didn't. This is still the old one. I forgot to start it. Okay, sorry, guys. Um, all right, so that's going to be it for this episode. We'll, uh, I'm just going to jump right to the next one. Thanks for watching. Uh, look at the next episode if you want to see how this game plays out. Sorry.